Well, a new face is leading the way here at Mount Juliet Middle. And with a new school year already well underway, it's also a season of new beginnings for these bears. <laughs> Just like the highly anticipated renovations at Mount Juliet Middle, the school's principal's chair belongs to someone brand new. Hey y'all, good morning. Camera shot right here. Good morning. <laughs> His name is Mr. Lee Nashan. Introduced over the summer as the new principal at Mount Juliet Middle, he took over for the great Dr. Candace Engel, who retired at the end of June. I'm very fortunate that this community has embraced me. The parents have been amazing. Um, the staff has been amazing. They've been through a lot. So I think their perspective is different than mine. I came in, I want things done yesterday. And they're just like, just relax, we got it. And the parents have been like that, and the kids have been like that. So the transition's been amazing. Now, even though this is his first stint as a lead principal, his resume is filled with leadership positions at schools out of district and in district most recently serving as the sophomore assistant principal at Green Hill High School. But upon taking this job, he candidly admits there was at least one concern. I was telling you earlier that I've worked in different places, very large school buildings, and I've never been more intimidated than to meet the sixth graders. <laughs> it's early, but so far, these students like what they see. Pretty good guy. Uh, yeah, he seems cool. <laughs> he seems cool. What about you? Uh, I've heard great things about him from other teachers. Oh, yeah? yeah okay. He's super cool, guys. Super cool. Super cool. We've got so cool and super cool. Yeah, um, yeah, um, yeah. So you <laughs> agree with, all, with everything they said, right? Cool, cool, cool. so cool, all so right. cool. And as he gets to know them more and vice versa, he brings a relaxed but authoritative style with him that he hopes will connect with his students and staff. I've been fortunate to work for a lot of really good people in the past. And they keep it simple. And then Dr. Engel was amazing with me all of spring, early summer, and spent a lot of time with me. So getting to know her, that really helped. When the job at Mount Juliet Middle became available, it was a situation for him that he felt deep down that he definitely wanted to pursue. For me to be a principal and take over a building, I wanted to be with a staff that had been through some stuff that had some little grit about them, and this staff exemplifies that. So. That was very alluring, and then this is the best community I've ever worked in. Um, and I've worked in some good communities, but this has been the best in terms of there's an appropriate level of involvement. Um, there is, the kids have a great energy. Um, teachers love working in the Mount Juliet area, so you just combine all of that and thought I'd take a swing at it. Now, with the entire Mount Juliet Middle fam all under one roof and no shared space among sixth and seventh graders, and the 8th graders not having to go to Green Hill High for their temporary home following the March 2020 tornado shuffle, let's all come back together for these Bears. And with their high academic achievements already in place from previous years, things sure seem to be moving in the right direction even more. Yeah, we have big plans for this place, but it had a great principal before me and Dr. Angle, and that the staff's been through a lot, and that as we're the building is still a work in progress, um, but I want to make sure I keep perspective that we're going to take our time and we're going to enjoy this process because the staff really needs that and the kids really need that. Mr. Nashan is excited to be part of the Mount Juliet Middle community. The history and the pride that these walls and halls have runs very deep. He understands that. He also understands what it takes to be successful and that's what he wants more than anything for his school to build off that firm foundation that's already in place and build their successes even higher. I got to meet almost all the staff this summer, so I got their perspective on what, as we came back together, didn't need to change, and that was really important. And not much needs to change. You know, we have some new staff members come in, so how does that fit? Um, as we come back to a, the school together, what do we need to focus on? And for us, it's just working together and taking care of these kids. and and then redefining ourselves of what it means to be Mount Juliet Middle School. Welcome aboard to Mount Juliet Middle, Mr. Nashan, and don't let those sixth graders scare you. I'm Barb Barker with Wilson County Schools.